Good morning, you guys. All right, so we have a little bit bigger of a craft today, and so that's why we're working with a little bit more space. All right, so this is what we're making today. It is so much bigger than it looks on there. It actually almost does the full length of the door, just a couple of inches on either side, so it's really quite large. I'm really excited because this is really easy and super, super cute, okay? All right, so what we're starting off with is these from the dollar store, and so they're already cut out belts. All right, and so as you can see, it is quite large. When I'm holding it up like this, you guys can see a little bit better how big this is actually going to be, okay? So um, what we have is the, the three different ones. So we have our acorn, our leaf, and our owl. And the owl has a little bit of sparkles, if you guys can see that. There's just a little bit. And of course, you guys can add more on if you want. So we're just going to cut off the tags. I cut off the tags on all the other ones already, so they're already done. All right, so that's one of the things that we'll need is the three different ones. Or you could do them all the same if you wanted. All right, and then we got the ribbon. So this ribbon was also at the dollar store, super pretty, cute. All right, and I'm not, I'm not quite sure how much I use, but I think it'll be enough to still use the same one. I guess we'll find out the hard way, right? If not, then you can just get a full fresh one and we'll know for, for uh, how many it can make. All right, so we're just gonna start off with that. And what I actually started with was the, uh, sorry, I'm just laying down that. Make sure you guys see if you're having trouble seeing, swipe the comments to the right. And maybe I'll move the camera down just a little bit. All right, it's kind of balanced there, so. All right, there we go. All right, so we're actually going to start with the owl. We're starting at the bottom here. And I found that that was a really good place to start, just so we know. I'm just going to go ahead and take... That is definitely not going to be long enough, so we're going to open the new ribbon. All right, so I'm just going to get that open for us. And like I said, we're going to start at the bottom. Hopefully it won't try and roll away from me. All right, so some of them have, as you can see, it's already cut out and stuff. So this one, let me move out so you can see. So this one, the hole isn't done. So just make sure you poke them all out. Some of the felt isn't fully cut all the way. There we go. All right, make sure you're doing the sparkles downward. Okay. So then the sparkles are on the front. So we're putting the front down. And I just did a little fold in this just so then it wasn't fraying up. All right, make sure you do wrong side up. And we're just gonna tuck it a little bit. And for this one to make it super, super easy, I'm just using a stapler. That's how easy this is gonna be. So literally anybody can do this, super easy. So I'm just gonna line it up about the middle. Oh, make sure it's on this side. Almost did it on the wrong side in my haste. All right, so I got it folded, got it situated, and I'll bring it up closer to you guys so you guys can see where I put in the staples. All right, so move that on there. It is a little bit fiddly, just trying to work your stapler around to the good spots to make sure you're getting it through the belt. Okay, so I'm gonna lift that up so you guys can see that a little bit better. And in the front, and it looks like this one hasn't gone all the way through. So if you have to put in another staple to make sure it's secure, you guys know me, I'm a huge fan of making sure that things aren't falling apart. So an extra staple to do that, and we're good to go. It's all the way through there. All right, then we're just gonna lay it down and get the next one prepared. You know what, I did the ribbon on the wrong side anyway. Shows you what happens when we do lives, I get too busy. All right, so then we got our leaf. We're just gonna give it a little bit of space. All right, that's because I flipped it over. There we go. All right, so I'm going to flip it back how I had it. When I showed it to you, I flipped it again. All right, so then we're just giving a little bit of space. If you guys can see here, I can see where the stem is. And I think that there's only, yeah, there's only about two inches in between. Because you don't want to give too much space because um, otherwise it'll end up too long and then it'll be dragging on the floor when you put it on your door, right? So I'm just going to put one there right on the, on the stem here. All right, and then I'm gonna go ahead and line it up. Make sure that it's going straight through the middle of the top. Okay, and this is kind of the hard part is just making sure that it's laying out flat, okay? So grab that spot. And that's just so it hangs better. This one's a little bit easier to get that staple in. And then I'm gonna go back down to the bottom. Sorry, I did that one a little too close. I'm going to go back down to the bottom and just find another place that I can secure it on the on a little bit more of the leaf instead of just on the stem. So that just means that it won't be waving around quite as much and hopefully keep it more secure. 
All right, so now this part is definitely the most tricky, okay? And that's because it's not flat. All right, so this is the extra I got. You guys can definitely do like a bow, just use some of the extra ribbon as you saw. So I had some leftovers, so if you have an extra, just to do a little bow or something like that, but I thought that this one would be a nice touch in there. And so that one's the most difficult just because it doesn't lay flat, right? So it's just that little bit more complicated. So I'm just gonna line it up, make sure I got it about centered, get a good staple in on the bottom, one side, then the other. I'm gonna do one more thing so I get it to the edge there. All right, and then the top, you wanna try and make sure you get it right lined up and you're trying to get it through the hat, okay? And there's a, the head is foam, so trying to get it through that foam will be next to impossible. So just get two in that hat and we should be good to go. All right, get my scissors before they fall. All right, lighting that up a little bit. All right, so it's falling off the other side of my table now, so it's got a little bit of a pull. All right, and then put it on the other side. Lining it up, giving just a little bit of space in between. And then, this is super, super easy. If you need something for your door to decorate, this is just about the easiest thing you can do. And it still be pretty. Like I said, it'd be really fun to add some extra sparkles to it. I mean, give it to the kids and let them sparkle it up, bedazzle it in some way. All right, I'm just lining up, making sure I get it all. And then at the top, once more, you could add a bow. Those that have seen me try to do bows before, I am not that good at bows. So I'm just going to do a little loop. Okay, so just a, I don't know, about six inches up, six inches around, so 12 inches in total. Just gonna cut that there. All right, and I'm just gonna loop it around so then it comes back around so then it has something to hang on. I'm just gonna staple it, try and get it in the acorn. So I probably should have done it a little bit lower. Actually, I'm gonna pull that one out. So then it's a little bit more secure. So then I can get it in the base of the acorn. And then it will have a loop. Hold on. The wire's getting caught on the felt. <laughs> All right, you know what? Let's do the loop the other way. I think it'll flow a little bit better. There we go. All right, and so I'm just gonna staple it into the acorn, do the other side, and then we'll be done. How fast was that? Definitely staples better when I have it on the table, so don't hold it up like I'm holding it up. All right, let's see. There you guys go. How super easy is that and fast? I mean, if you wanted a quick decoration for a party or something like that to put those around and pretty dang an expense too. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. And um, if you guys have any questions, go ahead and put them in the comments. If you guys are interested in um, my YouTube channel, you can go ahead and put it in the comments and I'll lead you to it. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, go ahead, like, share, whatever. I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day and a great fall and we'll talk to y'all soon. All right, bye you guys.